Welcome, children, to the Realness of Fortune Ball. Category is Vanna White Realness. I can't believe I'm walking the runway on RuPaul's Drag Race. I'm serving Vanna White realness in black sequins. I hope Michelle thinks I'm eloquent. Yeah! Beautiful! <laughs> Hello. Vanna White, what are you doing here? You can't do Vanna White realness without me. My goodness, you look gorgeous. Stunning. Tens, tens, tens across the board. Yes. Oh, thank you. I got to tell you, I am a huge fan of America's Game. Now, would you like to give Drag Race a spin? I would be honored. Category is Vanna White Realness. First up, Jinx Monsoon. Oh my God, that's Vanna White. And she's wearing black. This queen stole my look. Black isn't the first color you think when you think Vanna White. So thank you for doing me that solid, Vanna. Come up and buy a vowel sometime. <laughs> yeah. Shay Kool-Aid. <gasps> mm. <laughs> oh. I'm serving dipped in chocolate Vanna White realness. I just feel so serene and classic. I'd like to solve the puzzle. Gorgeous. <laughs> Monet Exchange. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you are stunning, Vanna. You are. I'm serving you sexy, thick icon, Vanna White. I have this high, high, high slip, and I think she looks fabulous. Oh, I ran into Monet. She says thigh. <laughs> <laughs> Jada Essence Hall. <laughs> <laughs> Vanna White is probably the first white lady that has ever been in my household. <laughs> That's good. We watched her every single day, and so I know exactly how to serve her like nobody else's business. Would you like to solve my puzzle? Ooh. <laughs> Raja. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> I would sit with my grandmother and we would watch Wheel of Fortune together. I'm sure wherever she's watching from in another realm that she's really quite proud of me in my almost exact Vanna look. I think she's coming for my job. <laughs> <laughs> Evie Oddly. Ooh. She is ginged for the gods. The category is Vanna White realness and this is my interpretation. I never wear wigs this big, and I feel like the most gorgeous bitch in this whole studio. <laughs> ah, <laughs> we're twins! <laughs> Ginger? I hardly even know her. The Vivian. Crushing the velvet. Oh, hi, me. How are you? <laughs> We've never looked better. <laughs> My Vanna White realness is this stunning peachy velvet number. I just feel gorgeous. A-E-I-O, you look fabulous. Trinity the Tuck. <laughs> Miss Vanna White is the only pageant queen on the TV. Wow. Oh Wheel of sparkle. Mm. Beautiful. Girl, I have so many rhinestones on this dress. She weighs a ton. This hair is back teased to the 1980s. I own all of Merv Griffin Productions. <laughs> Category is before and after. Up first, Jinx Monsoon serving whatever happened to baby Jane Fonda. <laughs> I took Jane Fonda as Barbarella, mixed her with Betty Davis as Baby Jane to create my favorite look ever. I'm really fond of this. <laughs> Shea Coulee serving Gold Tooth Fairy. She's coming for your crown. Girl, you better watch it. I got the attitude. Like, you don't want to run into this fairy in a dark alley. She got her little wrench, and she is going to come and repossess those gold teeth because you've been late on your payments. Takes a licking, but keeps on <laughs> ticking. 
Monet Exchange serving Bob the Drag Queen Elizabeth. Ooh, she's coming straight from Tuckingham Palace. <laughs> I'm doing Bob's iconic neon paint drip look reimagined. It's a very Queen Elizabeth silhouette with a Bob the Drag Queen twist. I walk into the palace purse first. Uh-huh. Jada Essence Hall serving Bag Lady in red. <laughs> <laughs> I am giving you a demure lady strolling through the park, feeling like a rich bitch. She seems like she has a lot of baggage. <laughs> I have my bags attached to this beautiful structured gown with some delicious snacks. <laughs> Is that a Twizzler in your turban, or are you just happy to see us? <laughs> Raja serving Olivia Newton-John waters. Ooh. <laughs> I've chosen a look that Olivia Newton-John is most iconic for, the sandy look in Greece, combining that with John Waters' pencil-thin mustache. She's bouncing a lot. I wonder if she has to zen a doo-doo. <laughs> <laughs> Evie Oddly serving Cardi B. Arthur. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> B. Arthur is not having it. Once I pop my jacket open and whip my hair off, I am Cardi B. The B obviously stands for boobs. Tits out, tongue out, ass out, letting it all hang out. She loves cheesecake and ass The Vivian serving Princess Diana Ross. Ooh. This is Diana's classic suit with an 80s disco twist. The hair is huge, giving Diana Ross at the Super Bowl. The Supreme Queen. Yeah. Trinity the Tuck serving RuPaul Charles the Second. Oh, <laughs> dear. Look at those knickers. <laughs> what did you call me? <laughs> Girl, I'm giving you some history. RuPaul mixed with Charles the Second, some king from overseas, bitch. I don't know. He just was a dandy, whatever that means. She's going for Baroque. Yeah. Category is Realist of Fortune Eleganza. Inspired by the lavender fields of Provence, it's Jinx Monsoon. Come on, purple rain. This is pretty. It's held together with hot glue and a prayer, but if I were in a Greek tragedy playing the goddess Athena, you'd buy that. Community theater, maybe, but still. I think she's going to mount Olympus. <laughs> Inspired by the white cliffs of Dover, it's Shea Coulee. Ooh, Ooh. I definitely do. I'm giving you Marie Laveau at her wedding. New Orleans, it's humid, so I got to put my hair up in this gorgeous turban and just drape my veil so elegantly over it. I now pronounce you stunning. Inspired by the green emerald isle of Ireland, it's Monet Exchange. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hair em. I don't even know them. <laughs> I'm serving you Irish disco fantasy diva. The afro is right, the jewelry is right. Baby, don't be jealous of my booty. I mean beauty. She's just now getting home from Studio 50 Whore. <laughs> Inspired by Hawaii's Black Sand Beach, it's Jada Essence Hall. Someone's been eating crow. Yeah. <laughs> I am really feeling this super edgy, fantastical fantasy. I am punishing the runway, and I feel like a sickening dark superhero. That's so Raven. <laughs> Inspired by the Golden Pagoda in Myanmar, it's Raja. Oh, Rue, I bet she can't wait to see how this turns out. Yes. I look great. It is gold on gold on gold on gold, golden goddess. She obviously is Miss Universe representing Myanmar. For fuck's sake, I give myself a shoot. You know, we should just sleeve her alone. <laughs> <laughs> Inspired by the pink city of Jaipur, India, it's Evie Oddly. Evie Oddly, very capable. Yes. I'm serving my best editorial ghost. I've got this dramatic cape, and I am flinging her everywhere. I want the judges to look at me and be like, what is this monster? <laughs> You've heard of two in the pink? Well, she got all three in the pink. <laughs> mm -hmm. Inspired by the great blue hole of Belize, it's the Vivian. Turquoise brings all the boys. I feel like 
$800 million. This dress is hugging my figure in every right place. RuPaul is looking me up and down, and I know she wants to wear this. Gorgeous. Yes. Inspired by Red Square in Moscow, it's Trinity the Tuck. It's the latex mm. in fashion. I'm giving you the only dominatrix fantasy realness with a mask and long hair all in red. Girl, I'm about to whoop somebody's ass with this little, what is it called? I don't know what they're called. She is heating up the runway. Ooh. <laughs> Guys, it's cracked. Crack kills. <laughs> hey, it's Michelle Visage. Do you want gay shit? Check out RuPaul's Drag Race YouTube channel and hit subscribe.